You may have seen that last week Roads Australia joined with 13 other industry bodies in signing a joint letter calling on Federal Parliament to play an active leadership role, driving improved industry culture and enhancing industry capacity and capability. The letter was sent because Federal Parliament is currently undertaking an inquiry into procurement practices for government funded infrastructure. Of course, RA has also provided its own individual submission to that inquiry, which will be available on the RA website soon. Procurement and risk is a complex and all-encompassing area that ultimately affects all parts of our industry. But ultimately, the issue is all about people. We need to ensure we have the workforce required to deliver Australia's massive pipeline of transport infrastructure projects. We want our people to feel that they are working in an environment which values their personal qualities, which allows them to innovate, and in which their physical and mental well-being is highly prioritised. One of the ways RA does this is through the mentoring activities, which form part of our Emerging Leaders program each year. In Brisbane this week, some of our emerging leaders gathered for a mentoring session that featured senior industry mentors from AECOM, BG&E and the Department of Transport and Main Roads. This session had a particular focus on embracing digital transport and how the increased influence of technology on integrated transport networks is changing our workforce. This also led into conversations about the skills and styles of leadership that will be needed to support this evolution and how emerging leaders can best prepare for and deal with the challenges ahead. Our Emerging Leaders Program is just one example of practical action that RA is taking to align our industry's workforce to future needs, building our industry's capacity and helping us to meet community expectations. Over the weeks ahead, We'll be sharing some other practical examples of how RA is connecting governments, industry and the community. These initiatives will help put our industry on a more sustainable footing and allow us to attract the talented and diverse workforce we will need for the future.